With a 4-2 conference record, the Trojan volleyball team already has the best conference start in school history. And they look to add to that lead this past weekend when they took on North Texas. The Trojans were able to sweep the mean green and move the 14-8 on the season. And head coach Sonny Kirkpatrick was proud of his team's effort. We played really well. Uh, we stuck with our game plan. We, we fed off of their, their weaknesses and we kind of fed our strengths. And uh, we played really well. Uh, couldn't, could not have been more happy or more proud of our team. Uh, offensively, defensively blocking. We really had everything click in and uh, it was a lot of fun to watch. The Trojans hope to carry that momentum into their Saturday match against ULM, who has lost nine of their last ten games. But the Trojans almost got more than they bargained for. Troy was able to defeat the Warhawks in four sets, but it wasn't easy at all. Troy gave up a 16-9 lead in the first set and would eventually drop that set. And they also gave up a 16-10 lead in the second set, but were able to rally and take that set 26-24. The Trojans would take the final two sets to win the match and make their conference record 6-2. and two, But Kirkpatrick knew his team should have played better. Uh, we just had to try to get out of that, that situation, and, and finally we did, but we gave up a bunch of points in that, and we really, we're not good enough to do that. We can't let a server get multiple points, uh, four and five, like they did. Um, you know, it was, it was just an ugly match tonight from us. The Trojans' next match is Thursday night in Sartain Hall against South Alabama. And Kirkpatrick sums up that rivalry pretty easily. They don't like us much. We don't like them very much. Justin McNeely, Troy Trojan Vision Sports.